Ooh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> big damage there with the Nair. Got all the hits. Oh! Such a satisfying uh, experience when you see all of Nair hit for the snake. Yeah, Nair to dash attack is true. Combo. Comes back to the stage. This time, PK Chris really trying to hold on to this lead. Gets the forward throw. No jump. Tries to get edge guard. Not cool. Oh! Thank you for oh, SD. No. Says PK Chris. Yeah, he just, let me just dive kick to my death real quick. You know, straight into the blast zone. Yeah, I mean. J oh Mark. my oh! god! What? Alrighty. <laughs> what? <laughs> what just happened, dude? Just so. What? <laughs> All I know is that it just sounds really weird on FT right now. <laughs> oh, it's Wii Fit, apparently, according to the chat. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I never play on that stage, so... Yeah. I would not remember. Oh, get him out of here! PK, yeah, uh... Rocket, damn. Yeah, all right, J, J Mafia is not a paid actor. I think PK Chris has adapted to the cost <laughs> Ever this green I, I, I didn't want to say it. I didn't want to say it, but you went and said it. I mean, that's the name of the me. That what? I'm just telling people what it is. Oh, you're uh, are you dead from this? Okay, no. I thought he was gonna force smash him while he's in yeah, the game. Yeah, I thought he was gonna do like four, baseball bat, but not quite. Jesus, he is getting beat up. Day Mafia. No answers right now. to get the down smash. That's smart. Can Nikita bring this back? Or is it too little too late on this first game anyway? I... I don't see Nikita bringing this back. Probably just bring it back to game two. But, it's still collect some data. Uh, oh. Uh, Never mind. No data, no data collection to be found. I knew I'd win. Ha. Man, I wish it was Chun-Li and not Ken. But I feel like just on the range, it, he, w he would still be open to a punish afterwards, so probably just wants to avoid that. It, even if he could, just go through. Oh! The, oh! the hard call out on the jump. Spiked into oblivion. Mal already up to whole stocks right now. Damn. He's, he really knows what to do against Nikita. It's just, it seems like he doesn't even care about getting hit by this. Yeah! Oh, he still gets the Tatsu out of it too? Uh oh. Dirty, oh my God. dirty the combo. Oh, double jump? Oh <laughs> my God. Closed it out. Nowhere to go. Mao with Mal the lead right now. Reading Nikita's entire soul. God dang. Got the dish. Ooh. Not dead, but wow, man. Dude, not, these are not, some not. hard call-outs from Mal right now. Yeah. He's like, well, Ness is in the air. Let's do a Shoryuken. Big opportunity for big damage oh. here. Oh, no the jab dash block. attack. Yeah, no jab no block. Jab block. I could have been jab block to like PK fire. <laughs> he yeah. jumped over him and he just Shoryu'd. He knows that Ness is going to jump. It's Ness, man. <laughs> yeah. He said stay grounded. You know, IRL tournaments and like the Smashville music would just be booming in the in the venue. Yeah. Like not not appropriate fighting game music at all. Oh, oh that was an appropriate down air though. Yes. Damn. That was crazy. Oh he tried to oh, down air him back. He to, yeah, he was like, oh okay, let me try doing that. Oh, he was, it looked like he was ready for the roll, but he didn't quite react in time, but he did have the positioning for it. Caught the double jump on stage, Apollo Kage in a very scary, scary spot, no jump. I love the way he challenged it. Oh, no way! Oh, the reset with the C4 to at the last second. That was incredible. Dude, that, that edge guard sequence was truly incredible. Apollo Kage very aware of the spot that he was in, challenged, uh, Recognizing it was the only option because they looked like he died that throw. Ooh! <laughs> Activated the pressure plate with the lava. I didn't even know you could do that. Yeah, getting a lot of mileage off these uh these uh dash tags from pretty far away. Uh but he he is approaching from slightly further away because he recognizes that Steve, not the most mobile character, excuse me, yeah. Enderman, not the most mobile character. So even if he does kind of see your approach coming, he does have to commit to a defensive option like a shield, a parry, a spot dodge, a roll to get out of the way. A lot of the time he can't just jump, he can't just dash. Because of his disjoint, lasting hitbox. 
All right, double forward air. Takes center stage. Still has the axe. Yeah, still has, I'm sorry. Still has the pickaxe and still has the sword. I thought something broke there. Wow. Yeah, recognize that he was right outside the range where any of Ness's grounded moves were threatening, so he off directly challenged it with the forward smash. Very good stuff and excellent timing to catch his ledge get up there. Wow, Jake's playing incredibly well this game. Down throw forward air. Oh, no, nice. Really well this game. Down throw forward air. Oh, no, nice. Goes for Nair instead. Back air to, yeah, I was gonna say, that's the first thing you'll see from Ness. Oh, what aggression here. He knows he's pulling out everything to stop him. Not even giving him the time to go for PK Thunder. Is there the forward air? Yeah, there it is. What a beautiful sequence. My goodness. Enderman. <laughs> that was actually cracked, yeah. Chat definitely has it right there. He is not getting caught by that dash attack, and my C catches him. Yep. My card activated. Quick, my card difficult to react to. He didn't get the punish off the grab. I'm surprised that wasn't quick enough to get the punish. That time, not gonna get the DI that he needs. Dash attack is gonna take the stock there. Oh, missed the dash grab he needs. That's gonna be a lot of damage. Oh, I thought he broke the tech chase on the platform. <gasps> Yo. <laughs> Watch yourself, PK Chris. Jake is playing incredibly strong at this moment. Very on base. Like it's so it's it looks so slapstick and funny. And wow, <laughs> he keeps his materials after he respawns, so he's able to come back straight up with some diamond with some diamond tools. Uh oh, he lost his jump. This could be it. Yeah. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead. Oh, is he? Is he dead? Oh, oh. no. He bounced off the wall, could have made it back, just messed up the angle. That was really clutch from PK Chris, but then he just missed. Still, but didn't quite time it right, allowing Mao to land on top of him um, and get the reversal off. But now, Mao in the corner once again. Okay. Then give up some space in order to get some materials. Order to smash. Stuffing him out of the, uh, the focus there. Oh. Yup, caught him out of his dash. Nice stuff coming out from Jake, playing that first game very solidly. Pretty much Jake at step one here. Mal has to climb up through the depths of his reset. Yeah. That's a back throw from position here. Can he read the reaction here? I like the play here. He stands a little bit still, looking to see how Jake is going to land and try to punish him accordingly. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Yep, caught the landing with the forward smash. Jake just 100% scouted it, knew it was coming. Oh, sh <laughs> oh! <laughs> look at look at him looking away. He's like moving his head. <laughs> I have never seen that actually. I didn't know. So a lot of the time they do that into the. the oh. He had that. He did. Yeah. He had that. He's and he's been trying to call out Jake on those, on those for quite a while, but he hasn't had much success. He's really scared to let. Yeah. Yep. Good game. So that was an excellent showing from Jake with the six. Oh, in grand. The main thing was that he was checking him out of his dashes a lot, and he was doing an excellent job of catching his landings. Um, Mao, to his credit, was positioning himself very well around the minecart, but a lot of the time, Jake was just a few steps.